Hi, I'm Herrick Kimball, and today in this video, I'm going to tell you all about the Carpenter's Measuring Code. The code, as I'll refer to it from here on, is a simplified way of recording or communicating fractional inch measurements without using fractions. I'll explain that, but first let me explain that I'm talking about uh, imperial measurements. Here in the United States, carpenters use feet, inches, and fractions of an inch. Now it's the fractions of an inch that we're going to focus on. Most every carpenter that I know uh, has a tape measure that has the inch broken down into 16 increments, sixteenths of an inch. So you have one sixteenth, you have two sixteenths, which is an eighth, you have three sixteenths, you have four sixteenths, which is a quarter, you have five sixteenths, you have six sixteenths, which is three eighths, and so on. I can remember starting out in the building trades and being pretty confused over uh, what uh, uh, fractions were in that inch. You know, I, could, I knew the quarter, I knew the half, I knew the three quarters, those were easy, but when we got into the uh, eighths and the sixteenths, it was, it was tough. That was a long time ago, but I remember that. I remember being, you know, a little bit nervous on the job site uh, trying to get that. Anyway, uh, you don't need to know that to use the code. But that said, everybody should know how to measure. If you're in the trades, you should know your fractions. You don't need your fractions with the code, but you should know them. The other thing about the code is that it allows you, as you're going to see, it allows you to dial in to half of a uh, 16th of an inch, which is a 32nd, uh, very easily. You can communicate down to the 32nd of an inch. Now, most of the time that isn't needed, but there are times when you really want to focus on a tighter measurement. You want to get down to the 32nd. But if you tell someone, hey, I need a block 14 and 11 30 seconds, that's going to stop them in their tracks, most carpenters. Uh, maybe there's a few that would know right off the bat what that is. Carpenters think in sixteenths of an inch. So what I'm going to show you can be adapted down to the 30 seconds of an inch without using 30 seconds of an inch. That may sound confusing to you, but it's really very simple. I've got a Sharpie right here. I've got a piece of drywall scrap and I'm going to put the camera over my shoulder and I'm going to explain this to you. Okay, let's uh, take an example of a cut list. I need to uh, cut blocks to go in a wall and I'm making a cut list of all the sizes first. And the first measurement is 14 and 9 sixteenths. Okay, that's how we would typically write that down uh, if we're not using the code. And we'll say the next one is uh, 14 and 7 eighths. And the next one is 13 and 3 quarters. And we'll do one more. Um, let's say we'll, we'll say 14 and uh, 3 eighths. All right. So those are the blocks I need. That's how the measurements are typically written down. But with the code, we don't use the fractions. We don't use these fractions at all. 14 and 9 sixteenths would be written down like this, 14 with a small nine and a line under it, okay? 14 and seven eighths would be 14, and we don't use the eighths, we're using the sixteenths, and we know that's 14 sixteenths. Oh, <laughs> so you just put the 14 and a line under it. I'm, I'm following what I'm saying. Uh, 13 and three quarters would be 13 and 12. Uh, 14 and three eighths would be 14 and six, okay? So it's, it's all sixteenths of an inch increments. We, we do away with writing those fractions. That simplifies it. And if I'm communicating measurements to someone else to cut these blocks, I'm saying, I need a block 14 and nine, okay? And they know what that means if they know the code. I need a block 14 and 14. I need a block 13 and 12. I need a block 14 and 6, so they know. They know what it is. The next step here is to uh, indicate if we need to be more precise. If we want to get down to the 32nd of an inch, all we have to do is 
at a plus or a minus here. So in other words, uh, if I want to dial down to 14 and 9 sixteenths plus half of a sixteenth, a 32nd, I would just go a plus. 14 and 9 plus. If I write that down, I know that's 14 and 9 sixteenths plus a 32nd. I don't have to know how many 30 seconds that is. It's just 14 and 9 plus. And same, the same. I can communicate that to another person who knows the code. So that's it, folks. It's that simple. Uh, that may strike you as odd, or it may strike you as brilliant. Uh, either way, uh, it's okay. But if you think that looks like a good idea and you give it a try, I think you will like it. I've used it for years. Thanks very much for watching. You can uh, watch my whole playlist of carpentry and woodworking videos at the end of this video. There's a link. And uh, thank you very much. We'll see you in the next one.